So we're starting out inside my past 1x2 that I was in yesterday, right? I don't know if my main base is rated. It might be. I'm seeing a foundation <laughs> missing. <laughs> Let me just take a quick look here. Yes, I got rated. Okay. Yeah, GG's to whoever rated me, man. I was saying that I was going to get on modded today, but I was just thinking, like, I mean, this solo season has only had, like, four episodes, which is a little bit strange, so I feel like I just want to keep on going with uh, vanilla. Ooh, there's actually an airdrop falling down over there. I need to try getting to that. It might be dark by the time that it lands, and I could be able to loot it. This is a server where I have no BPs, so I didn't really want to get off that server just because I had BPs on there, and I didn't really want to go through the whole grinding process of that again, just getting basic BPs, but... It's obvious that I'm probably just going to get raided on loop on that server. Like, I moved to, a, like, a completely different area. I still got raided, so. Yeah, Dylan, sorry to say, but the boys are probably going to be showing up here soon. Dude, no one is here. I might just be swapping. Dude, I literally just now saw a naked running around down there a second ago. Hey, there's literally gunshots right over there. I'm, I'm shocked I was the first person to that. Yeah, I think that I'm just going to make my way over to Outpost and then drop this 153 scrap on a jackhammer. And then, I mean, like, with us having two satchels, we could recycle one, learn bean can, then learn satchel. We could fucking raid today if we want. So that'll be kind of cool. We should definitely do that. Then we have two guns to work with. We just need more ammo, which we could just learn pistol bullet and craft up more of that. Got a hatchet. That's big. to hurry up now dude i gotta go please have meds for me have an extra gun for me i mean okay dude this guy what the fuck is all this okay, so he lived literally right here if he had a better gun inside of his base then i would have literally been fucked so let's uh be grateful i guess dude i can't carry all this different shit though Oh my god, fuck off. Like, that's what's crazy, man. Look at how much people I'm running into, and no one got to this airdrop first, man. I got really lucky with this shit. Okay, I need to get the fuck out of here now. Alright. Home sweet home, guys. Home sweet home. We can deep all this different shit. We already have a thousand or eleven hundred frags. Almost four hundred scrap. Looks like switching servers might have been the right play with how lucky we're getting today. Now let's get out of here and let's go buy a jackhammer. I mean, shit, do I just buy like a metal pickaxe instead? I almost, I'm almost tempted to. Like a jackhammer is nice, but I mean, I'll just buy a jackhammer or whatever. As you one comment, haven't watched your videos in a while, but catching up and loving your content. Keep up the good work. Will you be running duo in the near future? Well, I ran duo last month, right? To like start out January for the new year. So I just recently played duo, so I probably don't plan on playing duo anytime soon, I don't think. I mean, it could happen, but I have no plans to at the moment. So I probably need... Eh, I don't know. Oh, shit, dude. There's a hazy guy pushing this thing. Dude, I am going to need to go down there and try killing him. I just have to. I mean, of course. Of course you do, Dylan. Fuck, man. I just need to get a base down. There's more stone here. Damn it, dude. Okay, I dropped the jackhammer right there. Okay, I dropped my 2k stone right there. Let's fucking go. Fuck, I'm trying to like not waste my incense ammo. Okay, done, you're wasting your incense ammo. Alright. Can you just die, sir? Just please, dear lord. Oh my god! This, I mean, he might have had syringes, I don't know, but... Don't mind me, guys. Aw, oh, paddle. Okay, never mind. Okay, I don't feel bad for this dude one bit. Yeah, I'm getting out of here. Oh yeah, Dylan, you need to throw the paddle into the fucking pole on the street, okay? There, there's actually someone that commented, if you throw paddles in trees, paddlers can just take the tree down, and then the paddle falls down with it, apparently, so... I need to be trying to throw them into the light posts as much as possible. That's pretty much all the stone that I'm going to need for my base, I want to say. Oh, fuck. 
Dude, that was just now a salvaged axe. Who knows how geared that guy is. Hello, sir. Dude, this is not good. Fucking hell, man. Of course. Of course. Of course. Of course, there's just a guy on the other side of my shack when I show up to I mean, I, I mean, you know, I've been having a lot of good luck, so it had to catch up with me at some point. So, like, I get it. I get it, but... <laughs> I don't even know if he's still out there. He could be. I have no fucking idea. I'm just gonna assume that he's, like, going back to his base right now to, like, get shit to raid this, and that right now I have a very small window to leave if I want, but I don't know if that's truly the case, alright? I'm fucking running. Okay, I wanna say that right there is the guy. Dude, I have everything on me now. Oh my god. <laughs> I need space for, like, building plans and TCs and shit, man. I'm gonna need to, like... Okay, there's another dude over here, and he has a paddle, man. Oh my god, the paddler's on this server already. Just go, like, right there, yeah. Okay. Okay, so pretty much we're gonna make that sheet, that sheet, that sheet, that sheet. Okay, everything else, actually no, that can be sheet, that can be sheet. Everything else can be stone, now. And done, okay, cool. Now we're all good to go outside and get our stuff from the barrel. And let me actually take out the hammer just so I can pick up the barrel afterward. Um, I think that it's like right here, yeah. Okay, barrel, you go down here, I guess, okay. Okay, we have a freaking base down, dude, finally, all right. See so one say shots, you sound depressed. One of the things I don't like about Rust is the raiding aspect, especially offline. Keep going, bro. I'm not depressed, I'm just waking up in the morning, okay? I'm waking up in the morning, so my voice might sound a little bit sleepy or depressed, whatever you really want to look at it as. Last time that I feel like I was, like, depressed in life, I mean, like, I've got, like, upset here and there, of course, in life, but not, like, consistently for, like, multiple days or anything. But the last time that I feel like I was depressed was, like, in 2017 or 2016, and that was when I was still living with my mom with her boyfriend that she was with for, like, six or seven years, and they were going through a breakup, and just hearing the constant arguing upstairs and just wondering, like, fuck, like, if they break up, what happens? Like, he pays the bills, my mom just kind of stays home and... Makes food, you know, he does, like, the traditional, like, woman shit. Meanwhile, he's paying the bills, but he has, like, a gambling problem. There's, like, other issues going on, like... But the way that I look at that is, like, there's many people that go through much more worse things than that. So I don't even know if I would even consider that to be, like, a depressing, like, worthy situation. But I actually do remember crying into my pillow here and there, just, like, just by myself at that place, though. Fucking paddle. Oblivion. I'll loot that guy here in just a second. I almost thought that it was this guy showing up to, like, come kill me. Or, like, showing up to, like, come and, like, shut the door from an outside bag. I mean, like, there is a chance that I could just walk up and loot this shit right here, but I don't know if I actually can. Hello, sir. I mean, I'll just fucking kill you and wait out the timer like it's fine, but... <laughs> there should still be, like, another naked in there somewhere. I mean, I don't know, like, can I just loot them? Maybe I can. I don't know. I don't feel safe going to the bodies. Like, there's a chance that I could... Aw, oh, dude, someone else is walking up. I have to just go for it. Okay. Oh, my God. Another fucking paddle, dude. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm leaving. Okay, that guy just, like, started standing still. Dude, that is so much loot right there. Oh, my God, dude. The pa the fucking paddlers, dude. 
It's not a joke out here. That guy is, like, trying to see, like, where I live and shit, though. Oh, my God, dude. I don't want him seeing where I live. Jesus. Like, just... Can we just stop, like, standing around and stuff? Yeah, that was actually my last bullet on him. I need to get inside my fucking base now. Last thing that I need to be doing is, like, shooting around here. Get inside the fucking base, Dylan. Okay. All right, well, the paddlers are striking again. Here we go. I need to actually just go and cook up some crude oil right now, so I think that's going to be what I do. It's about to turn dark, so... It had to have been close for the turrets to start shooting me, because there is one that's on, like, this side of Outpost. There, I don't know, there is one corner of Outpost, and I don't have it memorized yet as a player. There's one corner of Outpost that doesn't really have a turret on it, and so you can get a little bit closer on that side, I think. But yeah, this side right here, there's a turret right up there, so... Alright, there we go. The paddle is up there, and it is on display. Aw, oh, shit. It's already being used. Damn it! Oh no, this guy's gonna be trying to go for pushing this dude out of the whole safe zone. I've went down this path before, man. It doesn't work. The dude always comes back right at the very end, as soon as he's about to be out of the safe zone. Okay. It's time to research this. And then I brought over just a little bit of stuff to make some ammo. Maybe that guy will be off of the refinery now. I hope that he is. I mean, I'll try pushing this dude out of the fucking safe zone. Oh, that guy's all done. Okay, screw pushing that guy out of the safe zone now. I, I, and again, like, sometimes I'm tempted to try. So it's like, why not? Try and do it. He could be fucking loaded. I've tried it so many times, even on modded servers at times, and the dude always gets back right as soon as he's about out. It's so annoying. All right, it's daytime. I'm getting out of here. All right, we back, we back. So, what is the plan? We're in a really good position right now. We have guns to work with and whatnot. Uh, how much scrap and stuff do we have? I mean, we're, we're sitting at 888, dude. I mean, come on. Yeah, dude, we actually, we already have enough metal frags. We got a fucking fully sheet vault, dude. Holy shit. Dude, by the end of the day, I can make this thing have to take, like, 8C4 to raid. I guess that I'm just gonna go on a random run over to, like, train yard or something. I'm probably gonna bring some, uh, scrap over to Outpost, though, to buy some grenades real quick, though. Dude, I'm seeing a fucking paddler down here, guys. I'm seeing a paddler. Oh my god, dude. I I'm gonna wait for him to go to that pile right there to my left, then I'm killing him. Let's go right over there. Cross the road. Just cross the road. Okay, just cross the road. Uh-huh, uh-huh. There you go. Oh my god, isn't it just disgusting, guys? The paddlery that we're all experiencing here. Dude, I can't wait till I die as I throw out paddles. It has yet to happen to me, I, I, I'm pretty sure. I don't think that it's happened yet to me. But it will happen at some point. I mean, the guy barely had shit. I thought that he was going to have more than that. I like how our time on this server has already been more interesting than, like past three episodes on the other server you know and this this guy is still just standing here i guess and i'm just gonna try pushing him out i don't know he i mean he has not moved since it was nighttime, so i'll invest like three minutes or two minutes that it'll take to push this dude out i guess the rust devs are like the type of guys to make it to where you can't get on anyone's head and move them as they're inside of a safe zone I, I, like why can i just see them doing something like that though you know like it's little updates like that that can happen or it's like okay what are we actually doing right now as a dev team Okay, I'm gonna try and do this right now. I mean, like, there's nakeds around here, though, man. Like, it's easier. Wait. He's, he's looking around. That's what I'm saying, though. That is what I'm saying. He's been gone for, like, 30 minutes. Then, boom. Let's just start looking around. Oh, I'm on Rust. That's right. <laughs> Hi, man. Let's go play Rust. I'm not lying when I say every single time that is what happens. So I'm just gonna move on. That guy can sit at Outpost all day long and just fucking look around as if he just woke up in Narnia and doesn't know where the hell he's at. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Oh my god, now I just look inside this and I see three boxes. Oh my god. I'm gonna have to raid that with tools or something. Oh shit, dude. Would you just look at that over there, my friends? Would you just look at that over there? Fuck it, he's just pulling up to his base right now. Almost. Oh, 
Oh man. Well played, GG's. This guy's probably gonna get up on his roof and kill this guy now though. This guy could probably break the lock for this shit. Uh, this guy just not spawned inside of it. That should have never happened. I feel like I should have gotten inside that camper and stole whatever was inside of it all day, but it is what it is. Well played to that P2 guy. I almost turned on him, but I whiffed. I only hit like three body shots. I need to hit like a headshot in that whole thing. Oh my god. Dude, I have never seen an animal just spawn fresh like right in front of me. Oh my god! I'm just going to put down that there. I'm just going to take out this, this, this. Just going to make a tier two right away. Then we can just BP syringe, then, then yeah, we can just roam around with custom afterward. Okay, let me get inside of here, let me research this, research this, all right. Okay, I'm gonna leave with 32 scrap, and I am gonna go and buy some, uh, some grenades, I guess. I don't know how I already have, like, almost, like, 2,000 cloth, but, man, we got hooked up on some of our kills that we got. Ooh, I wanna go to that, though. I wanna go to that. I'm just gonna have to. Fuck grenades. It was in the same direction in which I just died, but I don't think that it was the same situation. It sounded closer than that. Wait, dude, wait a second, wait a second here, wait a second here. Oh my god, we need to loot and fucking scoot, dude. Two, okay. Sir, don't start swing, swinging your rocket. Nothing, okay? Let's calm down. I feel like the Tommy guy is the guy that lives in the base that has the car, and that the P2 guy that was dead was the guy that shot me in the back. Yeah, lucky cleanup right there, for sure. I was not expecting that Tommy guy to just be in the woods there. Just now got another 400 cloth. <laughs> like, jeez, okay. If that was actually the P2 guy that died and then the Tommy guy was the dude that owned the car, because I was like in the tree line right next to that base, and that's uh, a pretty beautiful thing. I'm happy about that. Okay, we're back with some more stuff. Let's get back out there with our custom, people the profits. And yeah, actually, yeah, here, I'm just going to use this one dude's set, I guess. Uh, this dude had boots, he had tack gloves, like, all right. Oh, yeah, by the way, Don. Make uh, two furnaces right now and get shit cooking ASAP. Okay, let's go. Yeah, today's already been a better day than like the past three days of this season combined, I feel like. Like the past three days of this season have been like okay. Like we hit like some nice flame raids and shit, but we're just catching up with the PvP now. We weren't getting a whole lot of PvP opportunities on the past server, which honestly it's like, okay, sure. Me getting raided on loop. Probably just for the best. Would I rather have like a long lasting season on there where I'm not getting raided and barely getting any PvP to where it's just kind of like it just it'll just feel like something's missing, right? Butterfly effect shit, man. Like if I have the best day that I've ever had on this game tomorrow on this server or another server, it all comes down to that server that we were on before. It'll all just come down to us getting off of that server that causes everything that happens afterward. Man, rest in peace, brother. Right, I'm gonna pick up this guy right now. Mm. Yep, now let's just follow the guy who killed me. Let's just be a dick. Good. I'm just gonna kill you if you're just gonna follow me like that. Like, I let, I mean, I picked you up. Yes, I took all of your shit, but, you know, it was still, I was still being a gentleman to a degree, okay? But you don't realize that. You have to try following me. Anyways, uh... Yeah, we're back home. Let's just keep these furnaces smelting shit up. I think that as soon as it's dark, I'm gonna try and bring some stone over to Outpost. Oh, shit, dude. I'm seeing someone in the distance. Oh, someone's building right here. What the fuck? I'm seeing someone, like, geared in the distance, too, man. There's someone over there that's like on that base. I'm tempted to just push over and try killing him. Actually, I just now saw him dropping down. One second, he might be coming over here. Yeah, I don't. I don't think this guy actually had like a really good gun, like you might have thought. You have a custom and you take my bow. It's like that. 
You're closing your front door, okay, pal? Taking the bow, bow. The bow. <laughs> I'll leave you your bow, okay, sir? I'll leave you your bow. This guy had a water pipe, but it didn't even have any ammo in it. Like, when I saw him geared in the distance, like, on top of that base, I honestly thought that he was, like, full road sign or some shit. Okay. Now we dip with... How much stone? 3k for sure. Um, yep, let's go. Oh, shit. That guy's right over here. I'm gonna feel bad for killing this guy, but... Picking up his backpack right now, okay guys? His backpack is literally full right now, what if I told you that? Full of what? Oh my god. Okay, we go back home, we depot, we come back. That poor fucking guy. He has a gun that's glowing, man. Like, oh, and now it's on my back. People can fucking see that shit on my back. I'm just gonna put my custom away and hope that my custom is on my back right now. Because I don't need this guy following me back home just because there's a glowing star on my back. Just let me get inside. Let me get away. Okay. All right. So, what's all in here? Just a bunch of just random shit. Not like juice, but solid shit. I mean, two hazmat suits. That's pretty good. Yeah, so yeah, this is just gonna turn into like a component run. I'm gonna go and recycle all this stuff and also buy 10k wood with this stone here. I swear if someone fucking followed me back home just now. There actually still is a chance. Jesus fuck. This guy just came out of his base that second. What the fuck? Oh my god, dude. Can I get a break from this shit? Like, like, I'd love to just go back home and depot, but that guy lives over there, and I'm not having it. Oh, yeah, so there is this newer clothing that came out, as you can see. It's like a new, like, camo clothing, so... Yeah, more camo clothing for the people that dislike it. They dropped even more, so... Yeah, just look at him over there, standing underneath the light. This guy thinks he's cute or something. I don't know what's going on. I can tell you this, though. He's a silly little goose. Yeah, the guy that I just killed is a neighbor of mine. He lives right there, and, uh... Actually, I'm seeing someone... Someone's literally crouching over there looking toward my base. I'm not joking. It, it's like he's just sitting outside of his base, like, looking at mine to make sure, like, huh, does he live over here inside this base next to me? And so that's why I didn't just now go in, because, I, I, listen, I'm careful about this shit. I'll play mind games with people when it comes to where I live. I'm looking over there, and I don't see shit right now, to be fair. <laughs> Dylan, jump inside of... <gasps> jump inside of your fucking base now. Oh my god, Dylan. Okay. Let's just depot some of that stuff away. We need to make another barrel right now or something for storage. Oh my gosh. Oh. Guys, I'm hearing shit outside my base. I'm telling you, I just not heard someone slithering around, bro. I might have to re-log under a different name to just walk out there with a bow and a boonie hat. I'm just going to be building in here super slow just to sound like I'm bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have the metal frags there. Okay, let me just walk over here. Pretty much what I'm gonna do right now. I'm gonna take out some of this wood. I'm gonna and, and I'm gonna make a campfire. Okay, I'm gonna make a campfire. Then I'm gonna relog. The campfire is gonna pose a little bit of a distraction because it's gonna be sound inside my base for the guy to listen to. And uh, yeah, it'll just kind of make it sound like I'm cooking food or something in here as I'm relogging. Right? I'm gonna relog under a different name right now though, and then come back over here. Okay, we're logging back into the server under a woman's name now, okay? And I'm going to be using a woman voice on the voice changer. It's going to be more of a grandma voice. But, uh, yeah, we're just going to end up leaving. And then as soon as he kills us, we're just going to be like, Hey, why are you camping outside my base? Or this is what it'll sound like. Hey, why are you camping outside my base, man? And then, little does he know, he thinks that he's camping out his enemy, which he is, but... He's going to feel bad because grandma's on the ground and she's sad, all right? She doesn't like being killed like that. Yep, this guy's inside of his base right now. Hey, that wasn't very nice. 
He doesn't care about grandma. Okay, whoa. That's fucked up, Jenna. Oh, he's outside my base. Hey, that wasn't very nice of you. I'm just your friendly neighbor. I see you just sitting right there. What are you doing? Okay, you're still just sitting right there. I see you right now. I don't know why you think that I can't see you. You're looking around and stuff. Okay. We go for the fucking one pump with the water pipe, alright guys? That's the plan. <laughs> okay, one minute here. Well played, well played, well played, well played. Hey man, what's up? How's it going? You just love shooting from far away, don't you? What did I do? Thank you, that guy was door camping me. I appreciate it, sweetheart. I don't, I don't know who that is, by the way. <laughs> oh, yes, the other guy died. Yeah, me jumping is what fought to me right there. I should have just jiggled this and killed him right there. I, I, I just didn't know, like, what spot he was in exactly. It's just weird that he heard every word that I said before I came out. Yeah, let's get inside this thing. Let's see, let's see what all these small boxes have. All right, nothing. That was definitely worth a shot, though. Uh, dude, I'm just wondering if I'm going to come back over here and this guy is going to be, like, on the outside of my base. It's just the fact that he was sitting there the entire time that I was, like, logging in and out, too, changing my name. Like, he literally sat there for, like, eight minutes straight for, like, nothing to happen. Oh, <gasps> what the hell? What? What is this? Is this dude about to raid me or something? <laughs> Dude's trying to online raid grandma right now. Well, time to start pouring some resources into the base, I guess. I don't know if I can actually make everything that I need to, or like, I don't know if I'm gonna have enough stone for everything. Maybe, we'll see. Oh my god, no, motherfucker, dude. Oh my god, I don't need to lose these fucking resources, man. I was just out there clearing it. Let's not have this guy just sit out here now, okay? Please get away from my home. I'm gonna be keeping a spawn on my bag inside my base this whole time. I'm like, I'm not gonna spawn on that bag is what I'm saying, like, just in case, because I don't want to be on timer or anything. I see you. It's not that serious, sweetheart. Okay, what's this guy's name? Jenna, it's him, okay. Dude, he's still just sitting there. Like, I see you. I see you. That right there will be the plan right now, okay? <laughs> Dude, Jenna hates my guts. Holy shit. I don't know if this dude is, like, still convinced that I'm the person who killed him outside of his base. Or what? I don't know. But, man, he does not like me one bit. I just see him sitting right there on the back of my base. Just standing there. You know, go AFK. Go make a fucking pizza right now in the oven. Make some homemade ranch while you're at it. I mean, fuck, dude. Just sit there, you know? Yep, I'm seeing him. And he already sees me. <laughs> and there's a crossbow guy near my base. You should kill him with your compound bow. Okay, well, I'm just gonna lead you to him, I guess, okay? Oh, uh, no, wait. <gasps> I like how that guy shoots me and not this guy. Yep, now he runs. Oh, nope, now he's dead again! Yes, dude, yes! <laughs> that is so great, dude. He is so mad at me, oh my god. Because he already got killed one time as he was, like, you know, camping around with, like, a DB and shit. Now he's getting killed when, uh... <laughs> After he kills a guy that I was like around right there. That, that is so fucking great. I told you not to try anything. Wait, is this him? Or is this the guy who killed him? Okay, yeah, no, this is him. Dude, let the other star guy come over here and kill him. <laughs> Dude, he raced outside of the SAR, man. 
And like I get that it's like with some of you guys it might just be like Dylan, fight him with a SAR. I don't want to give him that that confirmation that it's me that killed him before. As soon as I kill him with a SAR, he's gonna know. Good job killing that guy. He's been door camping there. Oh no, now he's back out of the DB. Oh Jesus. Yeah, he was full HP. Like it's so obvious that you're just sitting out there right now. I see you right now just sitting there, dude. <laughs> he definitely just now heard that, Dylan. <laughs> and to confirm that he's actually still over here, though. I'm not seeing him. Jenna, you can't hide from me. I don't know where he is, guys. It seems like he might just be gone, but at the same time, I don't know. I feel like he might be inside of, like, his one-by-one one right here. Just waiting to hear me jumping around and shit. That's what I feel like. I feel like he's inside this shit. I almost guarantee it. Let me uh get into like the contact menu. Enemies, Jenna, last seen 4 minutes 31 seconds ago. Okay, one second. Let me just walk up to this and then just listen. Okay, guys. Let me go right here. 4 minutes 40 seconds ago still. Okay. Did that damage this? Oh yeah, it did. <laughs> I'll make you come out here, buddy. Okay, I will. I'll just destroy your shit out here. Alright. Oh shit, there's actually a raid going down over here. I'm gonna go counter this, kill the guy with grenades, and come back. Oh my god! Oh my god, dude, he's dead. Holy shit. This guy, he has shit. Oh my god. Oh god. Oh, I gotta get out of here. I don't know, like, based on what I just had previously seen when I came over here looking for this guy, I never saw him, so I don't know where he is. From my knowledge, I'm fine to just walk into my base. But, you know... Maybe that's not the case, I'm not sure. Yeah, we're back inside, just now got some sulfur profit, some metal profit. Fuck yeah, dude, we take that. All day. Back up off of me. You're no sweet art of mine. Alright, let's recycle this. Yeah, this is gonna be really big for us tomorrow. Well, I mean, I'm gonna get raided, so we're probably gonna be on a new server tomorrow fucking around. Or maybe this server, I'm not sure, but... If you made it here to the end of this video, comment the word bandana. I'll see you tomorrow. Uh... I'm getting off of the full sheet vault, just like yesterday. We'll see if I get raided. I mean, we're obviously... That, that solo guy over there is kind of beefing with us, so... And he set up, like, a weird-looking base outside my shit where a turret pod can, like, be made and whatnot. I don't know. Like, it looks like a future raid base. Really don't know how confident I'm feeling about this and me not getting on here tomorrow raided, but... I'm gonna be pre uh, prepared for it, but I guess it'll all try and remain optimistic enough to expect it to not happen, okay? Prepare for the worst, but expect the best, you know? Expect the best, be optimistic, you know, you have to bring these things to life by putting the right energy to them, I, uh, I feel like, but you need to also be prepared for the other outcomes, right? I just moved all my stuff into a shack nearby, so good luck. Yeah, we're gonna need a little bit more scrap to research P2. Do I even care to research people? Dylan, just research Revolver. Who cares? Yeah, I'll see you in the next one, my friend. You have a beautiful one. I'm going to go and do the same, and we shall see if we can continue on here tomorrow. So, yeah, goodbye now. Peace.